Changes in the Pakistan side. Morning, Ramiz. Is... Morning, Ravi. Yes, Yasser Ramid opening for Pakistan and Arshad Khan coming in to uh, lend some support in the spinning department. Mohammad Khalil and Taufiq Kumar, the two ex from uh, the team that played in Kolkata. Saurav Ganguly mentioned that the toss he expected uh, the pitch to do something in the first half an hour. The Indian team pretty much the same side that played in uh, the last test match in Kolkata. India winning that game to take a 1-0 lead in the series. What they'll want uh, in this game is a big performance from Irfan Pathan. Good shot. Punch down the ground. It's a quick outfield. And the first boundary of the test match. This shot will certainly relax his nerves. Anything can happen with the first ball he faces. And something's happened. Caught it first left. Drab at the catcher. Balaji strikes Pakistan one down. Just mentioning anything could happen. It did happen. Playing inside the line of a ball that did not deviate a great deal. Good neat catch by Rahul Dravid. India off the mark, Shahid Afridi gone for not four for one. So the Centurion of the last test match, Yunus Khan comes out to the middle. 147 in the last test match in Kolkata. Nice shot. Everything correct about it. Should get two. Now he's edge that. The finger has gone up. Loose shot outside the off stump. Two wickets and two overs for India. All Irfan Patan did was to angle the ball away from his off stump and he hung his bat at that one. There you see that bat away from the pad. Not a great shot. You've been given a chance. You need to capitalize on it he didn't gone for six Pakistan in trouble seven for two well the stage is set for this great Pakistani batsman captaining his side here today playing his hundred test match in Zamar Mulha comes out to the middle as he's done so often in the past with his team in trouble and he's off the mark in style a firm push to the offside Gives him his first boundary. And you can't have two openers. Great shot. Great shot from Inzaman Such an easy pace pitch this Sanjay. Nice shot. That's four. And once again, easily done by the Pakistani captain. Once again, that shot square on the offside. It's a lovely shot. That's four more. It's a beautiful batting track. He'll pick up runs. Two of them. The runs in a quick fashion. That's played away brilliantly by Enzama Malak. It's a glorious shot off the back foot. That also raises Pakistan's 50. That is four. Jabba Jay, Jabba Jay. This, is, this is an extremely good start by Nzama Mulak. That's gone through. They'll run away to the boundary. Anil Kumble bitterly disappointed with that effort from Balaji. Oh, that's four. He's used the pace, panned it around the corner. Like I said, he's looking ominous from India's point of view in Zaman. Runs coming thick and fast for Pakistan. The bad ball's being put away. Again, a short delivery it gets the treatment. This time it's Yunus. Flicked away for four. Bad start for Balaji. On the toes of Inzamamul Haq. He's batting magnificently. What a way to bring up a half century in his 100th test match. 
This great Pakistani player rises to the occasion. It's a good attacking field. He's found the gap. This ball will win the race, will it? No, Harbhajan is after it. He'll stop it. And Zamam off to a rollicking start. More runs, another boundary. When Zamam Ulak is on song and on course. Oh, that's a cracking drive through the offside. Beautifully played by Enzo Mamulak. He'll get another boundary through the off. Cracking drive. This time it's uh, gone through mid-wicket. This is excellent batting by Enzo Mamulak. Zamam has uh, used his feet, danced down the track and reaches his half century. That was upish, but he'll find the boundary on the offside. And another very good innings uh, by Yunus Khan. <laughs> Terrific shot. The entire body weight of N Zamam going behind it. He gets his run, he gets his hundred. What a player, what a stage to get your 21st Test Match 100 playing your 100th Test Match. A moment to relish for all of us. Brilliant batsman. That's a great drive, what a lovely drive from Enzamamulak. Against the spin and he found the gap. Zaman will look for two. And get it easy. Oh, once again in the air, but it's again going to be well away from the fielders. Two more runs to Pakistan. That'll be it. Yunus Khan gets his eighth test match hundred. What a knock, what a partnership, his 800 coming in 35 matches. His partner gets his 150th run, comes back for 151st. It has been a heavyweight partnership and in Zamam al well, he raises his back once again. He has been absolutely brilliant in this particular knock. So the highest score on this ground. Uh, some big names there. Tachin Tendulkar, Sunny Gavaskar, Clive Lloyd. Surprising Arun. No one's got a double hundred on this ground. Normally it's a good track for batting. And smashed away through the offside. In emphatic fashion and... Uh, No third slip. And into the boundary. First runs of the morning. He's been trying hard. Again, it's a quick outfield. Second boundary of the over. And straight away on the pads, the finger has gone up. First ball he took a wicket on day one. First ball he takes a wicket on day two. And it's a cracking delivery first up. Amulak just a little lazy, probably just a little tired also from that marathon knock. And hit the back leg and was plumb in front. But what an innings from in Zamamulak. It was a master class from a master player. Gone for 184, 331 for 3. Yusuf Yohana comes out to the middle. India finally breaking the partnership. Walked away on the onside for a couple. 337 for three. Lovely shot. Johanna at his best. Ah! 
big shout to Todd behind and Yusuf Yohana is walking back. Harbhajan Singh gets his first wicket. Boy, he deserved it. The line is good. Just a hint of turn and straight off the face of the blade. So Yusuf Yohana departs for 37. Consistent bats in Pakistan. Little hit. This is in the air. This could be out. Yes, it is. Harbhajan Singh has just scalped Asim Kamal on the sweep. Wait for a very long time. In fact, had to wait for 19 deliveries to get his first run. And then this shot against the spin. Top edge went in the air and an easy catch for Saurav Ganguly. So India strike immediately after the lunch session. It's a good breakthrough. Asim Kamal gone for 4. 4.28 for 5. Harbhajan. A push and he's taken up the result. That's the third wicket for Harbhajan Singh today. He's bowling well. Allowing Harbhajan to bowl to him. This is good flight. The ball dipping on the batsman. Not quite there for the drive. And uh, that's classical off-spin bowling. Harbhajan Singh gets his third wicket. And uh, Pakistan now 446 for six. That's gone fine. It's Gautam Gambir who's chasing it, but he'll give up the chase. That's the boundary and that's his 200. What a fantastic achievement. They all rise. They all rise because it has been a wonderful performance. Fantastic innings. That's crashed through the offside. He'll not be too much bothered about that last incident. At least that shot shows that another cracker of a shot he's enjoying this now what a good shot yes one can resist the temptation the other irresistible You could see Kamran Akbar was playing the numbers game. The sweep, then giving himself room. That will interest Ashraf Khan in the Pakistan bowling lineup. Have a look. Wasn't short enough. And there was the ball turned a mile. Taking off the leg stump. Kamran Akbar departs after scoring 28. Five. There, he, there he goes. Fifth time he raises his back to the gallery. What a knock. And what a reply from an extremely hard-working, talented cricketer. Run out. Easy one for Gautam Gambhir and Karthik Sami decides to walk back. He won't even try to get back. It's a good alert fielding from Gautam Gambhir. Sami, I think, sacrificing his wicket because uh, the priority for him was to get Yunus Khan on strike. That goes up in the air, it's going to be caught Irfan Patan under it, and he takes the catch, and Harbhajan has got five wickets. Great comeback for the off-spinner in this innings, but it also brings to an end one of the greatest innings that has been seen on this ground. The marathon innings from Yunus Khan, 267 and it comes to an end. That's a biggie, but not big enough. Straight to VBS Lakshman. Danish Kaneria, the first ball that he faced was looking to hit Harbhajan Singh out of the ground. That's a good shot. Off the back foot, enough time. He's punched it hard. That's a handsome boundary. Shot. What a shot. That should be for. That's really bread and butter for Gautam Gambhir. Onto his pad line. 
He's gone over the top and that is a huge hit into the crowd against the turn. That is been in the Sehwag for you. He's played that through the gap, that will be four. Pickish outside edge again will race away to the boundary. So the runs have come, pick and fast for India. Nicely played. And nicely placed. There's a good effort in the deep for Masha Khan. And once again he goes through the offside. Only fractionally overpitched, and that was good enough for Brenda Sevak. Now that's better pace, but he's got it away. He finds the boundary and gets his half century. And his wife there applauding. And what a series uh, he's having, Berinda Sevak. Bad shot. Second slip takes the catch. Sami has struck. And India have lost the first wicket. Be very disappointed with that shot. We're just talking about how well he was playing. The line. Hung his bat at that delivery from Mohammed Sami. He was troubling him. A little short and just followed it. And followed it uh, safely into the hands of Yunus Khan. What a test match this fellow is having. The ball's run that's driven beautifully through the offside. That's a classic way to start the session. He's on 99. What a shot. Just a mere caress. That's it. He's got it. His 10th Test Match 100 and she's relieved as is this man on the screen, Virinda Sehwag, what a master player. And the clever one at that, he saw the opportunity for a single. That's gone through, that's the boundary. It's Yunus Khan who uh, tried extremely hard to stop that cut shot. but not now he plays a lovely cut shot. He's a smart operator. He knew exactly where the field was placed. That's gone for another boundary. Don't bother running after that. Well, fine. Idea was right. Direction not. So that's what. Field from uh, the bowler and he's got him. He's got the big man, the big wicket. His home ground continue. Little predetermined. It's a straight delivery onto the pad, going right across. Absolutely straight, heading towards the middle and leg. Umpire had no hesitation. So Dravid gone on 22. India in a little bit of a problem now. 172 for two. Another classic on show here. Sachin Tendulkar, over 10,000 test runs. Average of almost 58. Oh, 80 start to his innings. He'll get a boundary. Mohammed Sami is very quick. Touch and go. Oh, that's rolled over. Good effort. There he is. The invitation was there and it's been heaved into the crowd raises his fist in acknowledgement quite obviously to the pavilion but where was it the dressing room or was it somewhere else in the air should be taken and a big wicket for Shahid Afridi and Pakistan Sachin Tendulka getting out he was looking to play the ball through extra cover stayed too much inside the line and couldn't propose the stroke actually locked him quite comfortably if you're not looking to hit the ball hard what happened is, uh, I think, just the bottom hand coming in too much, and playing inside the line, and miscuing it. Execution not correct. 257 for three, India. Oi. Nicely played. That's four. He's not taking too many risks now. Sewa, he knows that India is in some trouble. BBS Lakshman drive always has a stamp of class. <laughs> what a shot. It's 
extremely difficult to play this kind of a shot it's off the back foot and in front of square on the offside through a pretty narrow gap there it is it's just a matter of time it's just a bit too quiet for himself he's not posing any problems to Virinda Seva Darshad Khan great shot this is Vivek Lakshman at his best on drive against the spin off a leg spinner that's Vivek Lakshman's trademark there it is finds the gap quite easily Vivek Lakshman brings up the 300 maybe Anil Kumble is a little better than Afridi 302 for 2 a great drive Tell you is a delight to watch Vivian Lakshman along with Yusuf Yahana, Inzamam, Sehwag. He's right up there when it comes to the sheer pleasure of watching. Oh, that's gone. That's gone through. Been called and by another quick delivery from Sami. That's in the air. Will pay him it off. and will reach the boundary as well <laughs> terrific placement not a boundary we knew bang <laughs> what a shot he was waiting for it he sensed the loser coming up from Raja. It could be out here. In fact, he's lucky the ball has landed in no man's land. And uh, a superb innings. They say fortune favors the brave. Second time he's gone past double hundred in test match cricket. And what a performance. His magnificent run against Pakistan continues. In the air taken. A tame dismissal. He was looking to work it on the onside, then wanting to change his shot. And in the end, a simple cotton ball. Ben. Not his dismissal. Have a look. Just turning a bit too early, only scooping the ball back to the baller. Big wicket for Pakistan. They have worked very hard for this one. Took a long time coming. 337 for Core India. Too easy. A lot of form outside the off stump. And it's been played beautifully. Oh God! Gone brilliantly done by Canaria. What a ball. And they're all stunned. They're absolutely quiet, stunned, and a little embarrassed because they know that they're on the big screen. But leaving the scene is Indian captain. Undone by a beautiful wrong one. Well, the confidence is low. It's the earlier ball that uh, prompted this shot. He may have decided in his mind, maybe I should look to attack instead of just defending from the crease. But Kaneria was smarter than the batsman. Bowl the Gookli. And we've seen him do that earlier also in the series, beating a left-hander with a Gookli. Excellent ball. Good wicket. 343 for 5. He's dashed that through the cover. The previous shot went straight to hand, but not this one. That should give him a lot of confidence. Lovely shot. No need to run for it. Oh. That'll go away to the boundary. We'll have to wait for the umpire signal. Led by, says Billy Bowden. Taken. That is a good sharp catch. That came off the middle of the bat, but went straight to Gully. And you can uh, sense the pressure now on the Indians. Absolutely. 
just a little too quick for Dinesh Karthik. He wanted to play it a lot squarer, but ended up playing it just that wee bit late and straight into Asim Kamal's hands. Just what India didn't want. Dinesh Karthik gone for 10, 374 for 6. It's nicely played on the onside, 50 for BVS Lakshman. And it's come at a very important time for the home team. Intentional, but out. It's a soft dismissal. He was looking to go over point. In the end, a simple catch to backward point. Yusuf Johanna accepts it gleefully. And Pakistan get what they want, an early breakthrough. It's a very important breakthrough and good thinking from Mohammed Samid. This was the first shot delivery. Ball at Irfan Pathan and was looking to hit the ball over the top of point fieldsman. Not quite timing it. And he had to pay the price by losing his wicket. He's walking back. India, 386 for 7. That's up in the air. Another wicket goes. Should go. Yes. Taken comfortably. And Danish Canaria will be very happy with that. You expected this kind of a stroke from Herbert Singh anyways. If he was lucky, he could have middled that ball. But the luck going in Pakistan's way. Good catch by Rizal. Eight wicket. And that's of Herbert Singh. 388 for 8 India. Given. And Balaji is uh, shocked to say the least. Attempting a sweep. And uh, maybe the bat hitting uh, the turf. They all went up together and Billy Bowden said it was close enough to call in favour of the visiting team. Balaji is not impressed. But he'll have to leave. One for two, nine down for 396 in there. Gets off the mark of the first ball. The first four of the bat in this session. Variation in bounce, slowness and pace. All can work against you. It's gone through. There's an appeal anyway. Leg by signal. That's a fine shot. First boundary for Lakshman this morning. I think he's put it down. Was there an edge there? It just seemed to be some sound. That's a fine shot. Now there's the opportunity and he's grabbed it. I mentioned earlier, ball four, ball five, the field will come up. Alim Dar of Pakistan as well, that's a fine shot. He launched into it, Anil Kumble. It would be a team better than all of us. It's quite amazing. Because he didn't quite middle that one. There was a sweeper point and just couldn't get around it. Oh, good attempt. You've got to say that was a good attempt because that ball was flying. That should be four. The terrific shot. Was Cover drive from Anil Kumble, majestic to say the least. Well, the ball is certainly sliding off the track. A run to Anil Kumble, brings up the 50 runs partnership. Oh, quicker one, bowling clean about. Far too fast for Anil Kumble. And the change working for Pakistan, a very good change by Yunus Khan. He read it really well and so did Shahid Afridi. And the Pakistani supporters are jumping in the gallery. They know that now Pakistan will have to play well and there is a chance. Just that window of, window of opportunity has opened up for them. It was that express delivery by Afridi which did Anil Kumble in. And again that strategy of not farming the strike eventually succumbing. Anil Kumble going for a very valiant 22. 
449 all out India. And he breaks it with a king shot. Regally put away through square leg. That's four. Just use the pace of the bowler. That's a good shot. Very good shot. The most confident shot he's played in this inning so far, Yasser Ramit. That's well played. He had to reach out for it, but he knew exactly what he was doing. That's beautifully played. One bounce over the ropes, four runs. Dropped. He's gone for it, it's in the air, there's a fielder under it. Will he take it? He can just wait and watch it sail over his head. That is a huge hit. In Once again, this has been smashed. That should be another boundary. Well, he is in line for the fastest trip. Has gone straight through. Probably come back for two, but he doesn't. Got him, got him. He's furious at his partner because uh, Yasser Ramit rightly was looking for the ball, waiting for... Apologies. That is a good shot. Four to Hamid. Lots of things happening at the moment. This is really exciting cricket going on. Now it's back live. Anil Kumble. That's gone in the air, but if on the ball under it, he's tipped it over for six. He's gone. Sachin Tendulkar round the wicket from outside the leg stump, getting the ball to turn. Shahid Afridi, it was just a matter of time when he'd go for that six. Missed it. And Sachin Tendulkar has his man. So good ploy there to get Tendulkar on to the attack. His job was done. Afridi taking a lot of chance. That is how he plays his cricket. It was an impossible angle really to heave the ball away towards the offside when a bowler is getting spin from round the wicket. But he entertained everyone here. One for 58, 91 for one. He's gone for the pull shot and he's picked a spot. Controlled pull shot from Yunus Khan brings up the 100 for Pakistan. Again a short ball, Harpajan Singh will not get there. There's another four for Yunus Khan. Tendulkar not happy. Telling the captain, just let me settle down, let me have one field for a while. Oh, Anil Kumble with a desperate uh, attempt at the very last minute. Two boundaries already from this over. And this man, as you can see, is not in a cheerful mood. That's 50. Oh, Yasser Hamid. Short ball. And it gets the treatment. That's nicely played. Should get four for it. That's a good hit. Very good hit. It's gone the distance for six. Excellent placement. That's a very good shot. Take a chance. That's that should be close. That looked close. We'll take a closer look. I think leg before our own. That's the one that carries on in with the arm, and that is Plum. Absolutely right. That was heading to the center of the center stump. Yasser Hamid, 76. It's 183 for two now. Great attitude. That's gone, that's played away in the gap. Placement was good. That's a big one, that's a huge one. I think that'll travel all the way. No, I think it's on the bounce and has thudded into those holding boats. Match 50. He gets there and Zamam is very keen. He outruns Saurabh Ganguly, that's his 50. Very good innings. 
another full toss and uh, another boundary to mid wicket sweet shot Balaji is in business is he or is he not that's gone through can the big pole and that's gone to the boundary like a rocket three men patrolling the fence on the onside goes for the sweep and once again super placement there you go Amir he's inching closer and closer to that uh, 100 run mark so finally in Zamaam Hulak has pulled the plug and he said uh, we are declaring the lead by 382 India need 383 to win first runs down to third man lovely shot of the resulting chase that's rolled over onto the practice pitches and he can't stop it oh great shot beautifully put away Reminiscent. Oh, that is problems. If it's oh, gone. gone. Unbelievable. It's a direct hit from Abdul Razak. And everyone is stunned here. What a wicket. What a bonus. Unbelievable. Gotham Gambit probably looking uh, to change the strike over, looking to get to his 50. But he misread it. Misread this single. The striker prompted Sehwag to come for that run and in Zamamul Haq and company were hoping that Razak gets it on target which he did in the end. Gone for 38, India were well, one down, Sehwag gone, 87 for one. Dravid who has walked up to his partner, probably would have uh, calmed his nerves a little. 89 matches is a fantastic player. Boy! He's got it away. He'll come back for two. It's 89 for one. Oi! His second 50. Looks a relief man. It's a little bit of booing also from the crowd, which is understandable. He's just run out Virinda Sehwal. Oh, was that off the bat? I think it was off the bat. Canaria has caught. But that's come off the pad it's a leading edge four runs 
That's close. That's gone. That's out. That's a major breakthrough. Gone to that with good swing bowling. This is what we were talking about. That's the length he has to bowl, curling into Gambhir, going across Gambhir, and then being struck. Maybe a little hint of an inside edge, but then maybe not. We couldn't quite be sure, but looked like an inside edge. Gautam Gambhir has gone for 52. It's 108 for two. There was a huge roar as Sachin Tendulkar walked in. Really an awesome record. That's a good way to start your innings. Smashing drive straight through mid on. He now equals Sunil Gavaska as the highest run scorer for India. Lost 
control coming. It's 
seems like it. Yunus Khan has picked up a catch at silly point. The batsman is walking and the ninth wicket gone. It's Harbhajan Singh who's walking back to the dressing room. Kaneria looking skyward. Only one wicket now separates the two teams. It wasn't still. Have a look. And the ball was pushed. He was juggling and at the last moment he was able to hold the ball. Brilliant catch. Now Pakistan. Only one wicket away from leveling the series. Was a good effort. Not to forget from Harbhajan Singh. 2 1 0 for 9. Pratibala Ji, the last man. That'll be 4. No chance of turning the strike around. Really to match India in this test series. 